The contract signing for the construction and rehabilitation of roads in Region 6 took place earlier today at the Albion Community Centre ground on the Quarantine Coast. More in this report. The government of Guyana, through the Ministries of Public Works and Finance, inked over 200 road contracts at a ceremony held at the Albion Community Centre ground in Region 6 earlier today. The contract signing was preceded by a brief program that sought to emphasize the importance of completing the road contracts and projects on time. The chairman of Region 6, Mr. David Armagan, stressed on the need to build the roads according to the specifications on the Bill of Quantities. We are building the roads for the people of the communities and therefore you have to build it to the standard in which these people want it to be built and the standard which is outlined in the Bill of Quantities. The region now will play an integral part in the supervision of these works. Because we go around, we meet the people, and we have these complaints. And so as soon as we get these complaints, we will make sure that we pass them on to the relevant authority to make sure that these things are corrected. Furthermore, the Minister of Public Works, the Honorable Bishop Juan Edgehill, warned the contractors against subcontracting the projects that they were awarded. You sign on the dotted line. You will account to the Ministry of Public Works, not a subcontractor. I hope everybody heard that very clear. When you sign a contract, and I show up, or the engineer show up, or Dr. Singh, who has political responsibility in Regent Singh, show up. We're not going to be talking to no subcontractor anywhere on the ground. We're talking to the person who signed the dotted line. The terms and conditions of the contract, you are responsible. And I will not take on this as an excuse. Well, you know, I give this man to do it and he gave these gifts and we're not going to accept that. If you dig up a road to, to start your work, you better keep working until it is completed. Senior Minister of Finance Dr. Ashni Singh delivered remarks during the forum. While we are signing today, or we will be witnessing the signing of contracts for 287 roads with more than 200 contractors at a value of $8.8 .8 billion. That is only today's ceremony. We have in fact had similar ceremonies and signed, had similar contracts executed for more than 800, in fact almost 900 roads, if you include the ones that we are going to be signing today, almost 900 roads with a total value of almost $27 billion, $26.9 Furthermore, he implored that the government will not be condoning delayed works. From the moment you sign this contract, you put up your necessary bonds, etc., and you get your mobilization advance, like somebody said earlier, boots on the ground, start the work. Start the work. Don't sign a three-month or a four-month contract. If you know to yourself that you cannot deliver this contract in the three or four months, the contract period that is stipulated in the document you're about to sign, we are going to take corrective and remedial action. Whether it means terminating the contract, imposing liquidated damages, blacklisting you, we will be taking corrective action against contractors who are not delivering work on time. Of the 287 road contracts awarded earlier today, 201 of the contractors were first-time bidders. Most of the road contracts that were awarded are expected to be completed within four months. Narima Ali, Channel 8 News.